Crowan County is hoping to preserve the history of the 1924 mining disaster in Crosby. Today, Milford Memorial Park is dedicated to the 41 miners who were lost when the mine collapsed. The nearby lake filled the tunnels with water and mud, making it almost impossible to escape. Seven miners made it to the surface safely, in addition to Gloria Perpich's father, who was called out of the mine just an hour before disaster struck. Something was broken and he got called up and it was 20 below out. And so February 4th and uh, did not want to go out in the cold, whatever. But yes, he had a guardian angel watching him. After a decade of work and over $800,000, the park on the ground above the old mine is now open to the public. It features a picnic shelter and boardwalk lined with the names of those 41 who lost their lives on that February day. With the development of the park, uh, people are, are excited about the facility to learn more about what happened here more than 90 years ago. Um, and so it is a humbling experience to finally get the facility developed and showcase the, the rich history in the Canyon Iron Range. Later this year, a canoe launching and fishing platform will be put in place at the park. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.